yeah, the day it was pretty pretty good for us, uh, for the whole team. Uh, I mean, just really really happy about the results we had today, me and the Tulio. Morgado just a little bit of bad luck, but he was fast. Uh, and look, looking forward for tomorrow, like P1 and P2 uh, in the final. Uh, just really happy. Yeah, I mean, the pace has been okay. Um, I think we fell off throughout the day um, as the tires got older and older. So I think tomorrow with the new tire, it'll, it'll be better. But um, yeah, I think we need to work on setting up the cart for the last six to ten laps. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I mean, we're starting on pole, so that's good. Diego's starting P2, so that's also great for the team. I think we just need to work together and um, yeah, hope for the best tomorrow. Um, it was a fun day to say the least. I mean, everyone's driving crazy out there. It's like a world championship on lap three of a heat race. Um, I mean, I thrive in those situations though. Obviously everyone knows how I am as a driver. So I've gotten quite a lot of respect for the most part. I can't thank my teammate enough. In the last heat, he saved my life. He got behind me, got ahead of me, told me to wait went in on a couple guys and got me a few spots. So credit to him, but it's been a fun day. We've made steps in the right direction. Should start in hopefully the top 12 tomorrow and challenge for a win. Yeah, um, I think like you said, we, we've had pretty good pace throughout all the heats. Um, yeah, a little unlucky in heat two. I think we probably had a shot at winning, but it's all good. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with the package. Speed, speed Lab Racing Engines has given me a great piece to work with, and the boys at Nash Motorsports have just done a great job with the go-kart, so can't thank everybody enough, and I think we have a good shot tomorrow at the win. Um, so my day was, it was, wasn't bad, but it wasn't great. You know, in the first heat, we struggled quite a lot. Made some changes for the second heat, much better. Made some more changes for the third heat, even better, and then, for tomorrow, we're feeling quite confident because I think we've still got a little bit more in us. Um, and obviously, it, everything changes every day, so we have no idea. Like, qualifying on Friday was P4, and now we go into Heat 1 to, today, and I was could have been outside the top 15 if it was qualifying, you know? So, changes every day, and we're pretty confident. Um, how can I start? Um, I think hard day, but... And then I think we found a bit of speed. First hit was a bit tough. I crashed in the first lap at the start, so I couldn't do much. I had the chassis all bent. So yeah, we take that. Second hit, um, starting in the outside 12 is not so easy, especially when you have good drivers around you. Um, I tried my best, but the speed was not amazing. So it's kind of hard to be there in front. I finished 11, but I had a penalty. So this put me back a bit. In the last hit, the third hit, um, the speed was there. I mean. Um, similar to everyone, just Norberg a bit faster than everyone, but was able to fight a bit, finishing ninth. Um, I think I'm really confident for tomorrow. We have some things to change. Um, I think we are going the correct way now. So yeah, we'll do my best starting from 13. I can only thank the team because they're working really hard. Um, all PSL, my mechanic, Ariel with the engines. Uh, yeah, and as I said before, it's like two weeks that I'm driving just KZ, so Start of the week was was difficult for me with no front brake, so something so strange. But I'm getting there. Um, a few weeks ago in the USPKS in Orlando, I started 13 the final, I finished second. So I think it's all possible, and we go ahead. Yeah, um, <clears throat> you know, first first uh, every single heat race we've been top top five pace. You know, like the we finally got the car running right, and uh, obviously had engine failure for the first heat race, which wasn't good. That really set us back and really hurt us. Um, but you know, just like the uh, second heat race, we had really good pace, and then I got punted in the uh, hairpin, and you know, I lost my forward forward head to go forward, and um, <clears throat> forward had a, a, a momentum. And uh, after that, you know, I forget where I finished. Uh, I got a pushback bumper penalty, but I luckily got it overturned. And then the third heat race, um, just the drivers that I'm around just are like they just don't care. You know, I just got blatantly just taken out at the start. And nothing really I can go and do about that. Um, I think we're the fourth fastest go kart on the racetrack. Um, you know, I'm happy with the, with the equipment that we have, but you know, we can't do nothing with it. And it's just from qualifying, it just hurt us so much that we're just stuck in the in that same position. I think I'm starting 21st or something tomorrow. Um, I think our pace is going to be really fast. It's going to be great, but if we can get through the start, who knows what's going to happen? Um, awesome if we get a top five finish, um, but we'll go and we'll go and see. Yeah. Um 
thought it was going to go kind of according to my normal single speed kind of schedule. Wasn't that great of a warm up, wasn't too worried. Heat one, cart felt really good. Uh, we got a Ben Axel on like the third corner and stuff, so we were still pretty good pace with the Ben Axel. And then, yeah, Austin just blew a motor and nothing Hayden and I could do to avoid it, so that kind of totaled that one. Um, second heat race, my skid plate got hooked all the way underneath, which was not fun either. And then, yeah, it was just like aggressive racing more than I've seen in a long time. In the third heat race, I just I didn't have the speed, so um, hopefully tomorrow is better. I know that everybody under Speed Concepts is really working really hard, and it's super great to be underneath the 10, and thanks to Mike Speed and everybody under here for the opportunity, and my parents, and just everybody that's helping me get here this weekend, and I'm doing two jobs. I'm coaching and then at a different 10, and then I'm coming over here and driving, so... It's, uh, it's been a fun weekend to come back and see all my friends and race against R Ryan Norberg, against him on a different team. But hopefully tomorrow we, we get going and hopefully a good result. Uh, today actually wasn't that bad. I mean, we had a P4 in the first heat, and then the second heat we had a, a fifth, which is just keeping it consistent. But when we got a, a penalty for cutting the track, unfortunately, which I like the video I did. So, uh, But then the last heat, you know, we... We actually were really fast once we got clear of everybody and uh, just fast in the wrong spots. I kind of said in the other interview earlier today, but just fast in the wrong spots. So it's, you know, you're catching people at weird times and uh, you can't really do a lot. So, I mean, we can put a fast lap in. It's just we got to figure out where to be faster that's more competitive. So, yeah, you know, we're, we're working on it tonight and really trying to figure out how to, how to change where our speed is. Yeah, I definitely feel really confident, especially after today. I wasn't expecting as good of a result that I had. I was expecting maybe top five just hanging around in there, but seeing how much pace I had in heat one definitely motivated me a lot more going into the next few heats. Heat two didn't exactly go the way I wanted. Um, just kind of fell out of rhythm at the beginning of the race, and it just it took me a little bit to start moving forward, but once we got there, I made a few moves, but couldn't quite get to where we wanted. Heat three, a lot better. Defended more on the outlaps, and then from there, just pulled away. That's right. That's that's what I am mapping about in this weekend. You know, I mean, uh, yeah. As you, as you said, you know, first first uh, heat I was the fastest. Uh, then second heat I think I was like the fourth fastest. But anyway, less than one tenth from the fastest. So we were always, uh, yeah, there like less than one tenth or even faster than them. So I mean, in, I just need to work in the in the pace during the the, the heat. The fastest lap I I, I have. So uh, yeah, I mean, with new tire tomorrow, I think I'm. Uh, I am safe. Always be, be, be faster with the new tire, so I hope that tomorrow when I put the new tire, fresh tires, uh, yeah, I can go to the front and yeah, hopefully I get the podium and yeah, let's see. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, um, I was watching footage with AJ after the race and I realized I could have gone by, you know, Carrera. He was holding me up a little bit, but hey, we learn and I'm going to be more aggressive tomorrow, so look out for more passes from me. Maybe a podium, who knows? I got the pace and I'm ready to go. Um, yeah, it's just frustrating today. I mean, couldn't really get by. We had pace, but we just couldn't get by. And then, um, yeah, that was it. So tomorrow we just need a bit good start, I think. Find a way to get around them. And then um, I think we should be able to, to check out. So hopefully we can do that. No, it's, a, it's been a di difficult day, to be honest with you. We tried a lot of things. The go kart has been running pretty standard since Vegas last year. so. Today we decided to work a little bit on it to see if we could make it better. The go-kart was already really good, so it, it didn't really uh, work out too well in the heat too. So I kind of cooked my rears uh, pretty ag aggressively. So uh, I went back to standard on third heat. Go-kart was really good. We were trying something on the in, in the engine side and um, it, it didn't work as good as we thought it would. So again, just trying different things for tomorrow's race. 20 laps is a long race. Whole shot, yeah, it's important, but it's 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 possible to pass here. So uh, AJ definitely picked up the pace in the in the in the last couple of heat races. So he's pretty strong. Marin is strong. So really, the top five is really strong. So hopefully, we have enough tomorrow, and uh, everyone in RPG is working hard to find those extra tens. I mean, yeah, the day worked out as good as it could have. Uh, I feel like I needed something more in that heat three. I mean, I felt like I was sliding everywhere, but it seemed like everyone was having the same problems. I'm learning a lot, so we make a small change for tomorrow, and I think it'll be good.